Hello everybody, this is Havoc. Welcome to part 46 of our Total War Attila White Huns Let's Play. If you hadn't noticed already, I have a new intro, as well as the new um, kind of give it a like support buttons, as well as I now have updated social media buttons, which includes my new Patreon account. Um, all of that was in my little new channel update uh, that you saw, hopefully, before this one. It released earlier... Uh, this morning on Monday. So go ahead and go check it out if you haven't already. Anyways, did a little rebranding, whole fresh new look uh, as we approach the one year of my channel. So last time, <clears throat> the main things is we now have Africa as our client state. Uh, it went very well. I didn't think it would, but it worked out in the end. So they are working and supporting us, which is fine by me. We have a new king. Our old one died, so Atana is now the king. Let's see if we can't find him. Who are you? The high king of someone else. Who is this? The Thuringians. Aha. I don't even know where my king is. He's gotta be. Aha. All the way on the other end. So Atana, he is a line of a long line of lines. And he has a son, Grod, who is 19, just now reaching the age in which he can be influential. What did you, what you Benguez? You can't be that. Required rank 2. Okay. We won't worry about it. So we have a new king. We have a new heir. And we did quite a bit of raising. We raised Sidimus. I believe we even raised Gorop. No, we didn't do that one. Uh, we raised Leptus Magna. And we also raised Sabrata. So, our goals here today, we're going to possibly even split up into Dimity, Dimity and Hadriamentum. These places right here should give us a lot of cash. So what I plan on doing is actually raiding a little bit beforehand. So for now, we will get as close as we can while we can still encamp. We are taking a little bit of a hit, but there's not really a whole lot <clears throat> that we can do. No, not all that we can do at all. So we're going to go ahead and hit that in turn, and let's see what everyone does. <clears throat> For those of you who don't know what a Patreon account is, just as an FYI, if you haven't watched our the channel update video, uh, Patreon is essentially a site where any of anyone can go and support uh, artists, YouTubers, anyone who is seeking assistance for whatever reason. You can set up goals. You can set up rewards for certain uh, tiers of donate donations, etc., etc., etc. So that's what I have done in order to help support my channel. Should you feel like it's completely, completely on your own, you're not. It's not obligatory by any means. But any donations will, of course, have my eternal gratitude. Just, yeah. I am not going to demand, because that's not how I roll. Join These war against Nobasia. Sorry. But yeah. So, go ahead and check it out. It's pretty legit. Uh, yes, I will give the blessing. Okay, so... What do you wish of me? Okay, so those guys are completely unguarded, which concerns me a little bit. Let's encourage descent. Critical success. I don't really think it did anything, but that's alright. Our shaman has leveled up, and he can betray. Oh, so that's kind of like an assassinate. Okay, interesting. Interesting. Who has the bigger... We're going to go here. We're going to raid. That'll give us 800. We're going to sit on the edge there. And we're going to push these guys pretty much as far as they can go. This is what uh, Sabrata, which is what that is, right? So we're going to stay in Leptis Magna. kind of reduce that 
horde rivalry. We're going to go in Garama. Yeah, Cassidimus is way over there. So we're going to sit right there. Get moving. And then you, sir, will come up next to him. Because we still have this army to contend with, which I may split this guy off and go after him. I feel like we could probably take him with just one army. Let's go this way. We'll actually try and hinder him so we can get there a little quicker. The reason why I raided, for those of you who may be new to the area, I need uh, just a little under 2,000 income from raiding, so we're almost there. We got cattle pins coming. We got an Elder Shaman Jert in nine turns, which gets us Network of Informants. We can build an Elder Shaman Jert, and we'll be good with our cultural victory, which is exactly where I want to be uh, before Warhammer comes out, because that's my goal. Said it lots of times, my goal is to have my Garamanchians, my Ostrogoths, and my White Huns at either a cultural or military victory before the end of May when Warhammer comes out. Because as soon as Warhammer comes out, uh, these pretty much these three campaigns are completely gone. They will all be replaced by Warhammer. I do appreciate the love and support you guys have given me on my Total War Warhammer videos. I am, I need, like I keep saying it and I keep not doing it. So maybe I'll just kick myself in the butt this week. Uh, I don't know much about Total War, War or about Warhammer in general, especially not the ancient era. I've played uh, Warhammer 40k, those kinds of games. But I haven't really played a whole lot of the ancient era. So it's exciting for me to get into it and learn myself, as well as entertain you guys and inform you guys, uh, to the best of my knowledge, on the Warhammer universe. So I do appreciate your support. Don't think it goes unnoticed. Africa just keeps conquering territories, and that doesn't bug me one single bit. Hostile Agent Activity Misdirect was a success, as well as the other one, Assassinate Vidius Viturius Curvus. Why? Okay. Um, okay. You, my friend, go here. Uh, we... Going to assassinate... Critical failure. What kind of crap is that? Let's assassinate. That assassination was a success. We're going to disrupt this settlement. It'll fail critically. So I lost two agents. Not cool, bruh. Not cool. Din Gizik has leveled up. We're going to give him ammunition for missile cav. And uh, Cav Commander. Um, I probably want this guy more than anything. Let's go out to here. And then you go here. Since neither of you guys make a whole lot, I'm going to group you together. They're kind of my new guys. See, we can do a spinner's yurt. What does their integrity look like? Their integrity is at plus one right now. So, we could do a storyteller's yurt or a nobleman's camp. Yeah, we're definitely going to go for a nobleman's camp. That'll give us plus five integrity. And then once they get growth enough, I'll push it there. This guy is leveled up. Um, authority. Got any authority going on here? We'll go down there. Looks like we are getting about 800 from these guys, so that will work. Indeed. I have my champions in here, FYI, because they actually rank up my units. Which I'm very much for. We're about to get goat pins. I thought we had cattle pins coming up. Nobleman's camp. 
I have a horde here that has cattle pins, right? Cattle herd. We need... Oh, for growth. I gotcha. I gotcha. Well, what I can do is I can actually do goat pins here. And I could actually switch to a cattle herd over on this end. I'd lose a lot, but that's okay. I just don't want to wait until four horde growth. These guys aren't going anywhere. Just kidding. I'm not going to do that. We'll end the turn. We're taking our time because I don't want to get caught by surprise uh, with these guys against the Western Romans. So if it seems like I'm being overtly cautious, it's because I am being overly cautious. <laughs> oh, Western Romans, you and your agents. Die, mother trucker, die. <laughs> We're moving through people pretty quick, and these guys just keep getting settlements left and right. Which is great. I'm just more concerned about opportune failure. Is this the guy that I'm wanting? Vedius Curvus? Yes. It is. I don't know, man. I'm just supposed to assassinate you. Failed. Uh, hinder army? It's misdirect. Critical success. Hmm, if I attacked him, I'd have to... I do have onagers, though. I could hire a mercenary. Just for the trip. Okay, so he will actually move out, so we will disband. Um, they're not giving us good odds, but I'm gonna fight it. Because I know we can beat them. Quick upload. I like it. Start deployment. Uh, we will just two groups here. Again, our goal, as usual, is simply to uh, get our troops in. As soon as we lose our ability to fire arrows, we will be good with them. I don't know why I just did barrage. That do, that's useless. And I don't know why I crisscross these guys. It's almost as if I don't really know what I'm doing, guys. I want you guys to be a little tighter. There we go. Shoot at him, boys. Brilliant. Brilliant. Come at me, bro. Oh, sweet. They both have this precision ability. Don't let him catch you. There we go. There we go. Don't let him catch you. 
Oh, so close. Yet so far. I'm actually going to lead these guys back over here. You're getting wrecked, son. Make sure these guys can't get get at me. Last thing I need is for them to sh throw their little pelums. Well, that was a nice hit. Getting ripped. Scoot back. Now oh, we've lost a handful. Mainly because I'm like fighting them on two sides of the map. Route boys, you know you wanna. Battle is turning in our favor. Someone got caught in a peeling fight. Majorly. Just sit there, that's fine. Maybe, hopefully, not even a hundred. He's just taking it. You know what? Let's get our guy over here. Enemy general is dead. That's good. Let's get over here. Get wrecked. That's pretty cool. <coughs> I like that shot. They're trying to be all sneaky sneaky on me. Run after those guys. Okay, almost all of you are pretty much out of ammo. We may have to do a little bit of fighting. Okay, you guys come out this way. Uh, you guys go here. Alright, are we all going to route? We are all going to route. Yay! Go here. You two go after those guys. You three go after those guys. Oh, uh, you go there. You finish off those dudes. We're gonna super fast forward time. Okay, as soon as he throws his last little bit. All of you go after him. All of you go after him. Just destroy him. Awesome. Decisive victory. We lost 63, they lost 1,000, and they had 20 left. Uh, they're dudes. Yeah. We didn't do too shabby. Oh. Oh, in the neck. I like it. I like it. Let's kill those captives. 
We didn't capture anyone, which is okay. Okay, so we really need to move up a little bit. So I'm going to cautiously move over here. In camp. Move over here. We have these guys. Uh, let's go over here. And in camp. This guy can go right behind him. He can encamp. And then next turn we'll get out of there. Let's see, we constructed goat pins, enemy killed in battle. Household gained, equipment contract. It's good for us. Okay, so we have 58, we would lose. Hmm, we would lose 60. Oh, can't afford that. So we'll just have to wait for this dude. Look at this. Yeah, we'll do that. Because then he can get to cattle pins. Part of me so wants to go back and kill the Eastern Roman Empire. I have the unit strength too. I think I could really completely destroy them, but it would be a bad, bad idea on my part. So I won't. Simple as that. Those daggum agents. <laughs> Let's see. Let's keep rolling. Oh, nice. Now we got Italian agents. That's right, punk. Back off. Hostile agent activity was a success. Other hostile agent was a failure. Other was a critical failure. Illegitimate birth. Or rank gained. And do this. Sapping all the way. Tactics harass army. I don't think we'll do that. Uh, we will go subversion, though. Uh, religious change, the Lachmans have changed to Greek Christianity from Eastern. Antians and the Western Romans. Hidden agent discovered. Uh, where is Vedius Curvus? We still have to try to kill him. We have six turns. Let's assassinate. Failure. Oh, we can't even do that yet. We'll disrupt settlement. Critical failure. I'm pretty sure he just came back from the dead. Failure. Man. What is up with that? Let's go here. We're actually going to move out of their influence now. We're going to move over into here. How close are we to getting... Oh, we did it. Nice! So we now have earned enough income from raiding. We've got that tech. 
We got the tech down. We need an Elder Shaman Jert and Cattle Pins. This is awesome. Ready for action. So let's go ahead and besiege. We cannot. On our way. Uh, let's go. Get out of my way. Hey, Dramentum. You don't have a very big garrison. Uh, let's besiege you. Actually, let's back off. Let's raid it, and then go here. Okay, well, I guess that doesn't matter. Get moving. Not possible. Let them um. Hmm. They will probably come at me. Yeah, let's go ahead and do it. Oh, not retreat, you boob. Let's go here. Let's fight it. I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. <laughs> Rain? No. Nope. Nope. Okay, <laughs> I guess we have to go with fog or rain. Oh, that's not good though. Between reduced visibility, it's a lot harder to ignite stuff, which wouldn't really be a problem. We'll go back here, and it may not be a problem. To be completely honest. Actually, you know what? Our reinforcements are over here. Let's deploy over here. Change it up a little bit because we always come in from that side. See, they are going to come at me. Shucks for them. We're going to super fast forward time get our reinforcements in. Reinforcing troops. And not a moment too soon. Just gonna let all of them come in first before I start grouping them. The enemy has been spotted. Is that everyone? Okay, it is. Uh, here. Okay, so you guys will go here. Heavy shot. All of you guys will go here. Heavy shot. Actually, you're going to kind of go over here. Um, let's go here. Now, those guys, those guys. And all of you five. I think our range is decently better than theirs. Maybe not. You know what, horsemen, you're actually gonna come over here. And then just make sure you guys know to retreat. <laughs> Any of you fire? This dude's gonna get demolished. He's going to get absolutely demolished. Yeah. Not a smart move on your part.
waiting for these guys to land. Who's this? Medium melee. Five. We'll draw you back here for six because we're just going to drop these guys in here. It's okay. Keep him alive. Enemy units have been rallied. There we go. Two. Our hidden units have been discovered. One. We got six. Coming in here. We got five over on the side. Go after those guys. It's an ambush. Yes, it is an ambush. Oh no. You guys stay over there. Who are you then? You gotta be six. Two's over here. Let's scoot back a little bit. One can actually come in. We can start actually like picking off units now. Everyone should route here in a second. This guy should route next. As soon as he does, we're going to call it. There we go. End the battle. Decisive victory. We lost 76 and took the city. Of course, we don't take cities, we raise them, so that is what we're going to do. <laughs> Hadramentum. Oh, that was a lot less than I thought it was going to be. Sad Panda. This guy has less. He needs to sack it. No, not raise it, dang it. You are an idiot. Oh well. We'll be alright. And he levels up. This is Grodd. Good. Grodd needed to level up anyways. Nowhere else we can move there. Everyone else has pretty much moved. Is that right? For the most part. Man, we just can't kill that guy. Alright guys, well you know what? Holy cow. They're just sweeping in from behind and taking everything. Oh, well, that's not my business. My business is moving on and pillaging Africa. <laughs> Anyways, that will end the part, guys. I hope you enjoyed If you did, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. We will keep plundering Africa. I'm going to let this be. I mean, to be completely honest. See what? It's already 450. We All we got is these two guys left. I feel like we can get out of Africa and away from the Eastern, uh, Eastern Roman Empire. I feel like that's a good idea. So, that's what we will continue to do. Follow me on Twitch, Twitter, and Facebook. Go to my Patreon account. Check it out. And if you feel the overwhelming need to subscribe, that would be absolutely greatly appreciated from me. Uh, check out the different tiers. Do whatever you want to do. It does not matter to me. Your support, regardless, helps me out. So, yeah, that's it. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you for watching. This is Havoc, and I am out of here. Peace.